see. Microphone. How's the sound? Yay! Thank you, face faceless internet boyfriend. <laughs> show where I make my way through this insert picture later book of 501 must see movies and I tell you whether they are must sees or must skips today we are in a new location with faceless internet boyfriend we're in faceless internet boyfriend's house he waved at you guys I have iced tea I have a delicious bowl of candy which I'm just looking at now and I'm actually really excited about oh my god there's pineapple and grape and strawberry I don't want any of the orange ones I don't have my book <laughs> we're just we're taking steps we're being forced into a digital age against my will because I don't have my book now and I don't have my dice so we're doing them both digitally We're gonna take our D6 minus one. D6 minus one gets us the first digit of our page number. Five minus one is four. We've gotten a lot of fours lately, I feel like. And then we take our D10, 400, and is it six? 465. <laughs> Now the magic TV will do the thing. We are in war movies. <laughs> Great. Wonderful. And the movie is called Von Ryan's Express. <laughs> are you guys ready to see something? This is me with glasses on. <laughs> okay. It is a USA movie made in 1965, directed by Mark Robson. Cast includes Frank Sinatra, Trevor Howard, James Brolin, Raffaella Cara, Raffaella Cara, and Brad Dexter. It was nominated for Best Effects Sound Effects for Walter Rossi, but it didn't win any of those Oscars. I do not read the description. Yeah, now I need to find it. Now let's play. Italy, August 1943. With the Allies poised to strike, the Germans seized control of Italy, so the war-weary Italian nation fought on, a prisoner of the German army. Oh no! There's an airplane. Why were they a prisoner? What was this, World War II? Oh no, the airplane crashed! Okay, so the Germans, something happened, but they're all speaking in German, so I have no idea. An airplane crashed, that's all I know. <laughs> it's Frank Sinatra! I think, is that who that is? Yeah. Frank? Trevor Howard in Von Ryan's Express. Ooh, cows! A Mark Robson production. Introducing Raffaella Cara, Cara, Brad Dexter, Sergio Fantoni, John Layton, Edward Mulher, Wolfgang Priest, with James Brolin, John Van Driesel, Adolf Spelli, Vito Scotti, Ricard Bacalai, and Michael Gluto. Music by Jerry Goldsmith. <laughs> Director of photography, William H. Daniels. I'm not, I'm not reading them anymore. I don't like reading. They're all marching really slow. Is it just how they march? Or did someone die? Someone died. There's a very sad looking gingery bearded man. Oh, he's got a eye patch. That means he's a bad guy. The sad looking ginger man is wearing shorts. I like him. What are you chanting? Oh shit, he's in trouble. There's going to be an uprising. <gasps> Oh, he only fancies. That's it? He's gonna go? I would never ever want to be an actor who had to say that. Someone's tapping in the same pattern over and over again. He's gonna tunnel through the floor of the train. And then what? <laughs> now, they're tearing up the floor of the train with a piece of the train. <laughs> Tore a piece of the train off the wall and they're using that to tear up the floor. And then what? I don't know. This seems very dangerous. How are they gonna get past the guards though? They now have a hole in the floor. So they gotta wait for the train to stop and hopefully it'll be dark. Get out and run away. And somehow they have to take out the guard. How are they gonna do that? Whoa. If you put a knot in the rope and then like garrot them, the knot will smash their larynx. Whoa, that's dark and also interesting. So precise though. What if the knot didn't hit the larynx? Yells an angry Italian. <laughs> oh, is it called Von Ryan's Express because they're on a train this whole fucking time? Whoa! He escaped! They're doing it! They're escaping! I, do, I don't want to think about the stunt dangers of that because they're just doing that. They're just dropping out from under a train. It's going real slow, but they're just doing it. Oh, and then they, they have to roll out between the... Between the oh, God, I hate that. I hate that. To roll out between the between the wheels 
while it's moving. Jesus Christ. We made it to the back of the train without being noticed. Oh my god. Okay, they're gonna make their way because all the guards are like sitting on top of the train facing forward, right? So they're sneaking up behind them and they're just gonna like garrote each one as they go forward. Oh my god. I feel like this isn't gonna go as smoothly as you want it to. Okay, that one seems to be going pretty smoothly. He puts on the helmet. All right, next one. And then he puts on the dead guy's jacket and helmet so if anyone turns around stopping before it's supposed to. It's not supposed to be stopping. Why is it stopping? This is a changing of the guard situation. Uh-oh. He can't understand what they're saying. Oh, oh, Von Ryan caught one though. Okay, Von Ryan's got a uniform now. Okay, so Von Ryan's gonna be okay. But they still don't understand German. What are they gonna do? Oh, they're doing it! They're attacking! Is this gonna work? Is it all gonna work out? Who knows? They all sneaked out of the train and like jumped on all the Nazis and took their guns away. What's that? Another train's coming? There's another train coming! They're stealing the train! <laughs> they have to steal the train now. <laughs> Here, take this gun. The train's moving! They did it! They hijacked the train! And <laughs> now where are they going? So Hermann Göring, das ist unsinnig. Ja. Sehr gut, ich werde es sofort prüfen. Thank you. Why do they have big stretches of movie in German and in Italian with no subtitles? What? <laughs> Sorry, you're all on your own. Go to either the mountains or the ocean. We'll see you again someday. Bye bye. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. That was a mistake. Go back. Get back on the train. Get back on the fucking train. Everything's like exploding. It's like fireworks or something going on. Better go freaking fast now. Boyfriend says he thinks they just called in the Air Force. I hope not! Because airplanes are faster than trains! Ooh, that's a pretty bridge. When's the last time any of you slept? And sadly, that's all you get. Um, because the Wi Fi was really bad that day for some reason, and the rest of it is just all frozen. Um, you missed a lot of good stuff, like me flailing and squeaking a lot about trying to get to Switzerland. I made a really good joke about when they got into Rome. I said that the building looked like the Parliament building in Victoria. Um, I also made another great joke that said that war is just the ancient and noble art of stealing a dead man's gun. Um, yeah, so for the rest of it, I put this one on my must-skip list just because personally, um, this is all about me personally, and I'm not a huge fan of war movies. I was kind of bored for a lot of it, and I probably wouldn't have chosen to watch it if it wasn't on my list. Um, but if you, here's the thing, if you like war movies, if you like, like, sort of old fashioned -y war movies, this is a very good movie. Like, it's a good movie. Like, if you like that kind of stuff, you will love this movie. I just personally didn't myself. Um, yeah. Thank you for watching with me tonight in my new location. Oh, there's video games for a console I don't own. Be sure to like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you can see my next movie. I'll be back next week. Mwah.